Well, there have been two additional cases confirmed overnight, taking the total in Scotland to three. This is not unexpected and, you know, we will see more cases identified and confirmed in the days to come. Uh, one of the uh, two newly confirmed patients is from the Grampian area, the other is from Ayrshire. Uh, one has recently returned from travel in Italy, the other we know has had contact with another confirmed case, although I would stress it's not the first confirmed case in Scotland. Uh, again, the public should be reassured in line with the principles of the containment phase that we're in right now. Uh, all of the appropriate steps are being taken, both in terms of caring for patients who are both clinically well, uh, but also contact tracing. So anybody who has been in close contact with any confirmed patients, they are identified, uh, followed up where necessary, tested themselves and given all of the appropriate advice, because that is uh, the action we're taking to try to contain the spread of this virus as much as possible. It's important to stress that contacts in, in this context don't mean somebody who might have passed a person with coronavirus in the street or had fleeting contact. Uh, it's people who have been in close face-to-face -face contact or who've been within two metres for periods of 15 minutes or more. And if the health protection teams think you're one of the close contacts of any confirmed patient, they will contact you. So if you're not contacted, you don't have to worry that you might have been in contact with somebody who has it.